What's up friends, it's Volt Firecore. Welcome back to Team Builder Tutorials. Now, like I say at the beginning of every single one of these, I am not giving you a tutorial on how to build this. I just wanted to rhyme uh, Team Builder with something. So I did Team Builder Tutorial. Now inside the series, I pretty much just take a tier, uh, this one being PU, and uh, make a team after it. So we've done OU and UU. So I'm gonna do PU since it's uh, at the moment probably my favorite tier. So um, yeah, let's get into this. I already have a uh, something set up, which is Gen 8 PU, since I don't play any other gens besides Gen 8. But um, let's see who we're going to start this team off with. Alright, the MVP for this team is going to be a Leafeon. Now, personally, my intro for Generation 7, or do Generation 8 uh, PU, was Leafeon. It's a chlorophyll ability, makes it two times speed inside the sun. And it can set up some uh, really strong moves to make itself really strong and slap a life orb and there you go. This Pokemon I'm pretty sure is actually banned to a PU um, BL or something or like RUBL. No, NUBL. It got chucked out of PU for a little bit because I'm pretty sure it was too broken or something. But uh, the whole reason it was broken is because um, uh, there was this, um, this, this, this Pokemon you could use being uh, Vulpix. Now Vulpix actually really sucks as a Pokemon, but it has the drought ability which brings up sun. And uh, Sun with uh, Leafeon, as you probably can expect, makes it very fast. You also can um, run a Heat Rock on that um, Vulpix, making its uh, Drought do, well, 8 turns instead of uh, 4 turns. But uh, Heat Rock and Drought have been banned inside of PU, so Leafeon fell back down since it's uh, not that good unless uh, you have a Drought user. But uh, we're going to build a team off of Leafeon today, so... Uh, before we continue, let us slap some moves on this Leafeon. Alright, here's the set that I decided on for the Leafeon. Very standard, like extremely standard. This is the thing that you're going to be seeing most often. Alright, so uh, this Leafeon has Leaf Blade, which is a very strong grass type attack, which gets buffed if he uses Sword Stance. Well, in this case it's a female, but whatever. I gave it Knock Off, since his Knock Off is just a really good move to have. And Double Edge, because um, Leafeon doesn't have very um, many moves, but... Uh, you know, at least it can do that. Um, this is um, an adamant nature, max attack, and max speed, and some special defense. I just uh, clicked the uh, the guest spread since, um, uh, you know, they had what I was going for. Um, now, you can actually run Solar Blade, which is a physical version of Solar Beam, which usually takes two turns to charge up, but if you have Sunny Day active, it happens immediately. So, I, uh, you know, if you have a Drought user, which you can't, or a Sunny Day user, which I will be throwing on this team, you can use a Solar Blade, which does a lot more damage. But um, let's put on a Pokemon that synergizes very well with this Pokemon. And here he is. So this is Meowstic. This is the uh, only Prankstermon that I think you can use, unless you want to use Morgram, but that's a uh, not fully evolved Pokemon. This is the best Pokemon you can use in uh, PU if you want to have a Prankstermon. So, as I said before, this is Meowstic. It is a, um, a Pokemon that I, quite, I like quite a bit. You uh, only can use the male version if you want Prankster, since the female version has the ability Competitive as their hidden ability. So, as you can see, this Pokemon has no attacking moves. You can throw Psychic on, but I just decided this was going to be a support Pokemon. So, basically what this Pokemon does is it uses its ability Prankster, which makes um, moves do, um, well, they have priority. If it's a, a special move, no. A status move. They have plus one priority and they go first most of the time. Unless you're using a move that um, actively attacks the target when, um, so let's say you want to toxic them with your prankster ability. If you're going actively towards your opponent with one of these status moves, um, dark types are immune. But if you're just doing something like sunny day, light screen, heal, bell, reflect, you're perfectly fine and you don't have to worry about dark types. But um, yeah. You could give it a Heal Bell for a Psychic or a Psy Shock if you want this thing to actually have some offensive capabilities. But I decided this thing was just going to be a hardcore support mon. So basically what this thing does is it sets up its Light Screen, its Reflect, it has the Light Clay ability, 
making it so reflect and light screen have um, eight turns of uh, activity instead of four turns. So your Leafeon is going to be able to eat a lot of hits. And if I go over to Leafeon, as you guys can probably see, Leafeon has a pretty decent um, defense for some reason. I don't know why it has so much defense, but uh, you're going to be able to eat quite a bit of hits. So if you put up a reflect, you're going to be um, eating it up like it's cotton candy. And I also slapped on Heal Bell, which is interchangeable. Uh, the reason I put that on is because your Leafeon has a chance of getting burnt somehow, so if someone wants to like Will-O-Wisp you, well, Leafeon gets very weak, so you want to have Heal Bell. Well, you don't have to, but, uh, you know, it's good to have if you really want to uh, have a full Leafeon sweep team. But, um, yeah, this is a specially defensive uh, Meow Stick, since I think it's, uh, well, again, I just did the one that they recommended, but I would not advise doing a speedy version, since it has the Prankster ability. You don't have to worry about speed, which is always good, since Prankster is a very strong ability. But let's uh, throw on some more Pokemon that synergize with this team. Alright, I slapped some Pokemon that I decided that they synergize well with this team, so let's go over them respectively. So we have the Blossom, which is quite awesome. Now this is a Chlorophyll, well another Chlorophyll Pokemon, pretty much does the exact same thing as Leafeon, but this is a special attacker. So like I already said, Chlorophyll gets times 2 speed, and it can use Quiver Dance to raise its um, speed, special attack, and special defense. I gave it Giga Drain, Moonblast, and Strength Sap. The Giga Drain and Moonblast are for some uh, HP healing and a good uh, move to do some damage. And then Strength Sap, just in case you really need some damage, since this thing is a little bit bulky. Just a little bit. Then we move on. We have the Heat More. This is a pretty basic Heat More set. This is one I see quite a bit. So this is a Life Orb Flash Fire set. Let's say someone wants to go for something like, I don't know, uh, well, any Fire type move on your uh, Leafeon or your Blossom. You can switch this thing in, and Flash Fire is going to eat that up very easily, since you are literally immune, and then it makes your Fire type moves faster. So Fire Lash is a very strong move, his signature move pretty much. Well, other Pokemon learn it, but I'm pretty sure it was his first. It is a, like a, an 80 base power Fire type move, physical, that um, guarantees to lower the opponent's defense, so that's pretty sick. It has Super Power, Thunder Punch, and Knock Off, just for some good moves. I decided to give it Thunder Punch for some coverage. I'm pretty sure some people run Sucker Punch along with it, so it's uh, you know able to go first if it wants to, but uh, I thought Thunder Punch was a good thing to have. All right, then we move on to the Poison Savali. So Savali is a pretty sick Pokemon. It uh, has the option to be every single type in the game. Well, yeah, every single type. But a few of those are banned from PU since um, uh, Fairy is NU and... Uh, Steel is NU, and then a few are um, NUBL, no, PUBL, or something like that. And um, then there are some that are below, or like they're so bad they're not even like able to be inside of this. But um, Poison and Fighting are the ones that are straight up uh, PU tier. So this is just the Poison one, since I like having Poison to hit Pokemon every once in a while. This is a multi attack U turn Sword Stance Rock Slide. Multi-attack is a 120 base power move that uh, changes depending on whatever the type of the Savali is. So this is a 120 base power um, physical poison type move. So it's like Draco Meteor, but it never misses. And you can use Arch Dance to make yourself stronger. I think Savali is a very strong Pokemon. And it's also purple, and I like purple. Um, yeah, I give it a U-turn to get out of there. And uh, Rock Slide just in case it needs to hit something else. Like if a Steel type comes in or something even though Rock Slide is not really going to do much to it either. And then we move on to the final Pokemon with a Lapras. So I decided to put Lapras on, since I really like using um, Grass, Fire, Water cores. Since it's a really good defensive way to build a team, you're pretty much um, able to dodge out of every single scenario if you really need to. And this is a, a Choice Specs Water Absorb Lapras. So I like running Pokemon that have the ability to absorb types, like Flash Fire, Water Absorb, Sap Zipper, all that kind of stuff. But, uh, yeah, if the heat more is in danger, you can just switch it out. So this is a freeze draw, freeze dry, hydro pump, thunderbolt, and weather ball. So you might be pretty confused what weather ball actually does. Well, it's a 50 base power normal type move, which isn't that good. But if weather is up, like let's say rain dance, sunny day, or sandstorm, it uh, switches to that type and gains its uh, power times two. So it becomes a 100 power um, fire type move that Lapras can learn. So, 
I think that was pretty sick, and it uh, fits well with our whole meow stick gimmick with the sunny day. But uh, yeah, I really like this, and I think this could work pretty well. Probably not going to be inside of a showdown showcase or a, no, a showdown all-stars. But this was pretty cool. So here's my PU team that I made. You can use it if you want, but I would not advise to. So that being said, guys, thank you for watching, and keep on the, hold, keep on the lookout for my videos.